Arsenal Fan TV lads, a uh, good performance by the team today and uh, particularly Theo Walker and Jack Wilshire, are the standout players. Yeah, Walker answered his critics today, all the ones about Raheem Sterling swapping deal. I know he said it last uh, Wednesday. But I mean, I was getting to him, don't worry. I, 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 I ain't forgotten him. <laughs> I think Jack Wilshere gives us something different, you know. Like players like him and Oxlade, when they get the ball, their first aim is just to just to dribble, like just to go forward, you know. Mm. Players like Meza Ozil, yeah, they're good in the final third, but that they, they don't tend to drive with the ball a lot. And I mean, Wilshere definitely has to start next week. Um, whether Ox Ox should be on a bench because he hasn't really got enough like match match fitness up yet, but Wilshere definitely has to start as as well as Phil Walcott. If that doesn't warrant a start, then God knows what does. Theo Walcott, you've been critical of him, no, but he's a bit of a he's, a he's a game changer. He changed the game against Manchester United. He came on, all right, deflected yeah, yeah. goal, but he changed the game. Worried them with his pace again today. Terrorised West Brom's um, defence with his pace. Does he have to start next week? Yeah, well, no. Let's let's get straight. I wasn't critical of him, but I, I said that he hasn't been on top form since that. Before that, I, I did. I, if you watch it back, I did say he's my favourite player since since he was at the club, mm, yeah, yeah. and um. Uh, but today he was he was sublime. Like all these years he's been saying he wants to play up top, and suddenly he's produced a hat trick right at the end of the season. But um, Walcott, I, I think he has to start next week. Whether he has to start because we've been playing play, players like Ramsey and Wilshire on the wing. Like so, you would, you'd you'd start him on the right. I would start him on the right. Him uh, Giroud up top, Lex on the left, and Walcott on the right. Because but the thing is with our midfield dilemma, I mean it's so difficult to pick because whether going on form you, you'd have to leave Cazorla out, but. Can you leave Cazorla out? Like you, you've got players like Wilshere who are putting in amazing performances, and, and as he said, Wilshere's so good at driving at defences. Like whereas players like Ozil, they're they're, they're good with a final ball, but Wilshere can do a bit of dirty work as well. So now, now, now listen, you guys all season, home and away, you guys. If we win the FA Cup next week, mm. and we finish third today, so so we don't have to do the qualification for the Champions League, would that have been a successful season for you? Uh, from what I want from Arsenal, no. But from what happened last season to now, it's it's an improvement because we're now we don't have to do a qualifier. But then again, you know, it's it's not really an upgrade, is it? Because we got I think we got less points than last year. I mean, what are we yeah, really does that on? does that matter? Less points than last year. Well, we not, finish higher. I'd we're, rather we're, get less points. Suppose we get less points next year and win the league. Do, do, we, does that matter? We've been, been fortunate. Liverpool have done crap this year. Spurs were never going to contest, but you know what I mean? Like Man United ain't really mm. been in their best. Like we've been quite lucky with the teams around us. Because if, if, if Liverpool were on form and Man United were on form... If, if, if. I know it's if, 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 but you know... You, you, Chelsea haven't been played well, we might want to leak. Uh, well, 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 have we kicked on? It's, it's, it, for, as I completely agree with what you said to me. It's like, for us kids, like if you, we want to win the league, obviously. But I, I see, I'm seeing things on Twitter, 10 years we've either finished third or fourth. I mean, what's all that about? We, we, we haven't been challenging, let's be honest. It's an improvement from fourth to third. But to be honest... But have we kicked on? Have we kicked on from last possibly, season? I, have you I, seen I was, improvements? I was going to go on to say that this year has been more than brilliant. What coming to, every, every single game, you know we've been there, every game. And I, I, I think it's been brilliant. Like Moments like Man United away. Things that no, I'll, not I'll moments. Never, no, no, games, but have so, we okay. kicked on? I want to find out from you. Because, from, you're, from, there, from, from, because from, you're there all the time, have we kicked on from, this from last, last season? Year, yeah, I would say we've kicked on. Okay, so just, I'd say that the, the squad, looking from now to last season, the, the squad look, looks stronger and we still need improvements if, if we want to challenge. Quickly give me a player each. Player each that can help us to win the league next season. Uh, Arturo Vidal. Edison Cavani. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> uh, listen, listen we will, it will be okay. Theo is on fire. We've got to play Theo. Mm. One way or the other, Theo has got to play. You can't, I mean, the man scored a hat-trick today. He's on fire. You've got to play him. There's no, no, no doubt about it.